Okay, so the first text entry method I'm going to show you here is using the on-screen keyboard in the tablet input panel or tip. You can see in the inset window here how I'm interacting with the UMPC. I'm using my finger to tap on the screen on the on-screen keyboard and that creates text in Notepad. You can see it's fairly slow but also quite accurate. So this is a very reliable method of text entry. It's great for uh, passwords and the like. The next text input method I'm going to show you is using the writing pad in the tablet input panel. You'll see that I'm using the UMPC's stylus here and I'm handwriting directly into the tip. What you can't really tell from the inset is that I'm having to keep my hand up off the screen here, otherwise you get what is called palm rejection. But overall, this is a fairly fast and very accurate method of putting text into a UMPC. The final method of text entry I'm going to show you is dial keys. So you notice I've tapped a little gray semicircle in the bottom corner to bring up these semicircular on-screen keyboards. And I'm going to use this by tapping on the screen with my thumbs. Now what you'll probably notice in this video, especially in the inset, is I'm getting quite a few sort of missed entries where I'm tapping a key and nothing happens, so I'm forced to tap again. And then occasionally I'll also get a double entry where I get two letters that show up and I have to backspace to get rid of one of them. So the dial keys, while it looks really, really cool, I find it to be just not accurate enough and much slower than just using the on-screen keyboard. So it's not a method of text entry that I tend to use a lot. That said, it certainly does have some eye candy value. It looks impressive. And for very short pieces of text, it can be useful. Um, when you're finished entering the text with dial keys, if we ever finish the text with all keys, then you can click the minimize button in the bottom corner, and you'll see I do that in a minute, and dial keys will restore back to the gray transparent semicircle.